Hello developers, this is my invoicing application and designed exclusively for Zetka in KSA. This version is solely intended for developers and here I have categorized as a three parts. The one is the seller information, the second one is the buyer information and the third one is the document information. Here I am using a data grid view. The seller information contains here a registration number, type of registration number, code and the address, country, country of the company and the company name, tax registration number. Here is the buyer information, registration number code and address, buyer name, buyer transaction tax registration number and address. Here is the invoice details, type of invoice, is the tax invoice, tax ex exempted, no VAT, zero rated goods. Payment code, invoice number, unique ID, invoice issue date, invoice type is the normal tax invoice or a credit note or debit note, invoice NNPN ESB, this is the uh, invoice type. Invoice currency code, tax currency code, invoice billing reference, any reference unique ID, payment mode, cash or credit card or whatever is the online transfer, whatever is there. These are the information for the invoice related. The invoice line items I have given here, this is the data grid view. I have taken as a sample quantity, type, tax percentage, this all are the dummy data. Here once you click the invoice button, it will send to Zetka sandbox and the response will store it here in the invoice hash signed xml embedded invoice unique id previous invoice hash and qr code here and signed xml this is for the standard invoice and the standard debit note and credit note here is the simplified invoice and simplified debit note credit note and also I have created a one PDF button. It will generate a PDF A3 ISO standard and also uh, it will attach the XML file which is generated here. For the attaching the PDF and creating the PDF A3, I have created one video. Please watch the video. The link also description in the below. Let us see it in functional how it will work. Invoice number, one unique ID. I will submit the invoice. It is clear. This is my QR code. The QR code contains this data. This is signed XML file name. Here is the previous invoice hash key, unique ID, encoded invoice. This is signed XML invoice hash. So this is the one. It's clear. The script also divided into multiple classes. 
and it will be very useful and you can integrate any of your in-house ERP application. If you would like to obtain the source code, kindly send me a message on WhatsApp and I will gladly share it with you. Thank you.